What's up, folks? I'm Olivia. I'm Ali, and you're watching SVTV. We are making stories by teens for teens. Creating a platform, finding character, and giving others a voice. This is SVTV. Next year, we will be getting new laptops. Here's some more information. Recently, Make sure the news has been released to students that we will be turning in laptops early this school year to be sent back to Apple so we can receive new laptops next school year due to a contract between SEMA School District and Apple. We interviewed a student to see how they felt about getting a new laptop and how they also felt about losing it before finals week occurs. How do you feel about losing your computers before finals week? I feel like... We probably should have them for finals only because with everything being online nowadays, it's going to be a change not having our laptops during finals and having to go back to paper and pencil. Even though some classes still continue to do paper and pencil, it'll just be an odd change. How do you feel about getting new computers? I'm quite excited for it because these laptops are old and some of the batteries run really low really quickly and so with the new computer hopefully it will not die as quickly and we won't have to worry about charging them in a second hour sometimes what are you looking forward to most about having a new computer like i said in the last one probably most about the new battery life and just hopefully newer features i guess i'm not sure how old the features are on mac on these macs but I wonder if the newer ones will be any different than these ones right now. So I'm both excited and kind of worried about that in that situation. Thanks for sharing your thoughts. Make sure to back up anything you need before you have to turn in your laptops as the data will be wiped on them. Now, back to your anchors. Make sure to take care of your new laptops. Now on to the rest of us announcements. Seniors, outside date forms for prom are due April 9th. If your date is an SHS underclassman, the form will be due April 15th. These can be returned to the front office. Enrollment for driver's ed starts today and will go through May 6th. The cost is $175 and can be found on the district website. Contact Mr. Tinsley if you have any questions. SHS is participating in a shoe and sock drive. There will be a box available for donations at the main entrance until the end of the school year. Contact senior Sam Ingram with any questions. We are currently taking submissions for senior thank yous. Videos will be shot during CALP in the studio starting April 6th. Please check your emails for the date and time of your shoot. For more information, check Schoology or email Ms. Deckett. If you are interested in joining the auxiliary dance team, there is a link on Schoology to the tryout packet with all information. Packets are due on the 9th and tryouts will take place on the 23rd. Battle of the Bands will take place on April 22nd at 7 o'clock. Admission is $3 in advance and $5 at the door. Seating is limited to 500. Make sure to get your tickets now with the link on Schoology. Now over to Haley with weather after this quick commercial break. At all school events and games, make sure to create a safe and welcoming environment. Follow Rule 52, display good sportsmanship, and remember all school rules when cheering on our teams. It's always a great day to be a Viking. Howdy Vikings, welcome back to your weather forecast headline. Uh, today, we got some sunny weather. Um, it's gonna stay in the 70s and 80s all next week. Uh, great weather for Easter weekend. 
Uh, for your hourly forecast, at 1 p.m. it's going to be cold out of 50. It'll rise to 54 at 3 p.m. and then rise even more at 5 p.m. to 56. For your weekly forecast, it's going to be staying in the majority 70 and 80s, uh, getting at its highest peak at 83 degrees on Sunday and Monday. Have a great Easter weekend. Now back to your anchors. Thanks, Haley. Easter break starts tomorrow. We caught up with some of you to learn what you have in store for the weekend. Um, this year for Easter, we're going to my grandparents' house. Um, it's really nice. It's going to be really nice to see all my family again. I think we're just going to go to church together and then have a nice meal at our house. get together with my mom's side of the family and have a big meal and exchange like Easter presents and before that we like dress up and go to church and it was really hard to not be able to do that last year because of COVID. It was really sad but I'm glad to be able to do it again this year. Um, Easter is probably my favorite holiday so there's a lot of my favorite parts. Um, I like how it's nice outside and it's spring and it's just like after winter. And I like um, a meal with my family. Like we always have ham and like potatoes and green beans and stuff. Um, not really, it's just, it's different than last year because we weren't able to, but we're glad to be able to get together again. Sounds like, every okay, no, sorry. Sounds like everyone is going to have fun. That's all we have for today, Vikes. Have a great four-day weekend.